everybody, I'm Sam Gupta and I study in Springdale School, Tholakwa. Uh, I'm studying in class 7 and I really enjoyed the course that HD School provided. At first, I exactly didn't know what was uh, what was HD School, uh, school Codeathon as I was doing it for the first time. But then I uh, attempted the qualifier and the mock qualifiers and they were very interesting and luckily I got into the finals also. So uh, I work really hard day and night for the finals because I knew it is a big competition and if I win this, I, I will get a platform to uh, show how I how well I can do coding as I'm doing it for the past three years. Okay. And uh, I won the codeathon, so that was very, that this is very prestigious for me. Absolutely. Many, many congratulations. <laughs> very useful yeah right have, have your friends also did your friends also uh, take up the course no uh, they really are not interested in coding they're not why is it today students i see everybody and i was reading you know mark zuckerberg and uh, the, the ceo of um, apple etc everybody says even bill gates he says coding is elementary learning it's like basic learning yeah, right? but everybody should learn. So why would your students not be interested in uh, your friends not be interested in coding? Because they are more into sports and they are not like very like techy type of. They are like to play sports and they are a type of a sports person. They don't like to sit on the computer a lot of time. But tell me, if we were to want a message from you for your friends, okay, and everybody across India for example, yeah, you experience coding and you know how helpful and how interesting it is. So maybe not all students would want to do coding, but definitely you can inspire a lot of other people who are your age group, students who are of your age or youngsters or even older than you to take up coding as at least basic coding as a learning subject. What would you like to tell them that why should they do it? It is basically the future. Everything is gonna be automated in the future. And people who will have jobs will be coders or into AI. So if you are not a coder and you don't know coding or AI, you don't have the knowledge, you will technically don't, uh, not have a job. Because in the future, there are automated cars, everything, everything. Right now there are taxis and drivers, but in the future there are automated cars and everything. And people will lose their jobs who are doing this. And if they are coding, they will still own products. So, uh, it is a very important skill for the future. As everything is going to be all that's the That was the answer I was actually looking for. And thank you. And I think that's a big round of applause for him. Because today, coding has is a part of every industry, whether it is digital, or non-digital space, right? Yeah. So just to think if you have to get to Google or you have to get to Facebook or any other industry, you should know coding, that's not true. Every industry is integrating coding into their every gateway, payment gateway or in the industry everywhere, yeah? So coding is the basic and I think every student must know the basics of coding, yeah. right? Would you like to become the brand ambassador of HT School and want us to put out your bites to inspiring other students that you know they must take up coding and you know you can do it at a later stage. You know, you can script it well so that you inspire a lot of other students. And you're rightly saying there might not be jobs if people don't know the basic skills of coding. Yeah. Right? Anything else you want to add, Pooja? We need to uh, I just wanted to tell, I have created a lot of apps also after the Codeathon. You can look some, at the audience. Some yeah. include Wordle and Mackler. So, Wordle is an application where you enter a word, you have to guess a daily word, right? Yes. A daily word will come and you have to guess that. So, uh, you get some clues in between and yes. everything. So, I have created that and then a similar type of concept uh, Mackler also has that in which you have uh, you have get, uh, you have a result of an equation and you have to guess the equation from what you are getting that result and you will also get clues um, moving ahead in the game 
So I have created all these games. So what is it called? Matler. Matler. Very interesting. So are people already using it? Yeah. Some of your who is using it? Uh, uh, I have uploaded it on my website and uh, my friends play, my family members play and everywhere. Tell me one thing now. So supposing we were to look at your app and the game, right? And like one task we have is we have to inspire students to learn coding. The second is if we want to go ahead and engage students that and inspire them to start playing such games. You know, I myself play Wordle, Sedo Curdle, and Primal every day. You know what are these? Uh, the I only know Wordle. Wordle. So Sedo Curdle is at the same time you have to make 16 words. Yeah, so that is very interesting. You must also try. There is one called primal. Okay, where you have to make prime words. Okay, you have to guess the prime word. It's a five-digit prime word. So I'm saying this matler that you've made, supposingly we were to look at it and we would want to put it on HT School as the app. Would you be happy and would you be willing to so that we can ask your friends and more people to come and play your game? Yeah, sure. Yeah, that will be I am sure you'll be happy about it, yeah. right? I think we can look at doing something yeah, yeah. like that. Yeah? yeah? Thank you. And at the same time, I would like to possibly pose this. Yeah, we'll give him a first big round of applause. Fine, very good. Many, many congratulations. At the same time, I would like to pose this. We could speak to all the parents and the students because these are amongst the brightest students that we have here in the community. And there are of course students from Bombay also. If parents were to agree, we could put together a team of these winners from Delhi and Bombay. And they will become, say, board members or the community creating members of HT School. You know? So we will be club, as we call it. We will call it the coding club, basically. The coding club. We are trying, we will try and make one. So this platform will be given to these students. Who will make the coding club on HT School, right? So they will be the key members. They will plan what needs to needs to go on their the air for the the coding community on a weekly basis, on a monthly basis. So the idea is to engage the students across India, yeah. And we will facilitate virtual meetings for these students. These students will get you know credit as the, the community board members or something, they will be given visiting cards from HT that they are the, the, the members of the, or the founding members of the coding club. So something like that we, can, we will be thinking of. But you, as parents, you think that will be something that will, you will be willing to get your students, uh, your, your, your children to get that kind of exposure? Definitely. And, yes? And do I have a nod from students also? Will you be willing to be a part of a team? that will put together the entire yeah, coding club and the coding community for us. Yeah. So we will give you a lot of exposure on, on social media also so that you can invite all your friends to join, play the, the games, upload your apps and plan an itinerary like at HD, on HD School. Um, we plan that what all should go out and you know which week, which day etc. Likewise, you will be working um, on HD School. You will be a key member. If I was given an opportunity, I would be really proud at your age. But I'm, and I'm guessing I have a nod from all of you, right? So let's cheer to that. Yeah. So we've talked about it as we as we finish this ceremony. Yeah. So Sain, um, you give us, um, you know, how you made the app and how you really liked the course, and we wish you greater success in life and continue to make your school, your parents really proud of what you're doing and uh, show also the way forward to all your fellow friends also, right? Yeah, I'm sure you, you would want to do that. And, I, and when the, as these pictures go out in the, on the HD school site and on our social media, please share it with all your friends, all of you should, yeah? They should know that uh, they could have participated and it's not only about winning it's also about learning something new right so you must share your experience and what we can do is we were just talking about it so that your other school friends also get inspired we will also deliver your the, your, the, the, the awards that you want at your school venue yeah, yeah? so thank you they're just taking a picture that's why come